Do you know that if you go to, let's say, a random place in Africa or in India, and you ask someone, so a regular person on the street there, how many Jews would you say are in the world? Likely, I've done this before. The answer will be, oh, there's got to be hundreds of millions. Why? Because the world is always talking about the Jews. Right now, in Congo, there's catastrophes going on. There are way more people being murdered, God forbid, horrible, horrible, than in Gaza. And yet, no one's talking about it. Why? Because for some reason, it's only interesting when the Jews are involved. Let me tell you something. Why is there such an obsession with the Jewish people? Because people sense that there's something supernatural. The Jewish people just don't make sense. Such a small people that have made such an incredible impact in the world. The most influential text in the entire universe is the five books of Moses. Beyond that, you have the greatest innovations that were brought down in terms of morals and ethics from that same tradition. In the realm of psychology, in the realm, you go across the board and you find the greatest innovators were all these Jews. How is it that these tiny people have made such an imprint? Beyond that, you would have been a betting man. You would have had to say, oh, the Roman Empire, the Babylonian Empire. All these people are going to totally outlive this tiny little pocket of people called the Jews. There's no way that they're going to have a lasting imprint that is bigger than the, these empires. And yet, where are they? And where are we? And we'll take it just one step forward, further. The amount of predictions or prophecies that have come to fruition from the Jewish text. Just where I am today. Who could have predicted that the Jewish people, after thousands of years of exile, and where they were dropping the ocean, in comparison to the, other, the numbers of the people around them, would continue to keep their tradition and still somehow make it back to their land and thrive in their land and surrounded by so many hundreds of millions that want to murder and kill them. We are a miracle.